Oh man, feels like our backyard is a perpetual mess. We need a solution for this, which is why my wife and I bought this deck box. Oh boy. Hope there's an instruction manual in here somewhere. Let's start by laying out the shapes we have. Rectangle, 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 rectangle. It's a lot of rectangles. Square, square. What's cool about this deck box is that we have here one, two, three, four, five, six flat shapes, two dimensional shapes. And out of this, we're gonna be able to compose or construct a three dimensional box. Now in the language of geometry, this box we're gonna make is actually called a right rectangular prism. I mean, who talks like that? But nonetheless, that's the language we use in geometry. Aha, left side. That helps. Right side. Now where are the screws? Place bottom panel on flat surface. Align bottom panel tabs with left side receptacle. Now you probably know how to recognize two dimensional shapes by their properties. For example, we know this is a square because it has right angles. And each of the sides is approximately the same length. In the same way, this is a rectangle because it has 90 degree angles and it has two pairs of sides that are the same length. Now as we extend this out to three dimensions, you can see why we call this a right rectangular prism because just like squares and rectangles have right angles, you can see that this box is gonna have right angles too. Come on, snap, oh, yeah. Oh, don't break, don't break. Yeah, this does not seem right. Now, as this box starts to take shape, you can see all the 90 degree angles we got going on here, right? Which is what makes this a right rectangular prism, those right angles. We've got 90 degrees here, we've got 90 degrees here, we've got 90 degrees there, and so we're getting all these corners. And by the time this whole thing is done, we can see how it'll have a lot of the same properties of the two dimensional shapes that make it up. It's gonna have two sides that are about the same length. It's gonna have two other sides that are the same length. It's gonna have four sides total, and it's gonna be made up of 90 degree angles. Those are all the properties of these two dimensional shapes. Now transformed into this cool three-dimensional shape. Last piece, yes. And just like that, from simple squares and rectangles, we've built a beautiful right rectangular prism. Stand by.